Bonjour. Today I will be teaching you about Les Fournitures Scolaires, which is also known as school supplies in English. And it's usually one of the first things that a French student learns. And so here we go. So first item that's awkwardly written by the title is Le Livre. Le Livre. And Le Livre is uh, a book or the book. And Le lets you know it's masculine. And you'll see a couple examples of feminine, but it's important to write down the Le or La to know if the noun is masculine or feminine. Next one is Le Classeur. Le Classeur. And that is a binder. Next we have Le Stilo. Le stylo, and that is a pen, le stylo. Next we have le crayon, le crayon, which is a pencil or the pencil. I keep on saying a, it should be the, on all these it's the. Next one, le feuille de papier, le feuille de papier, which is the piece of paper. Um, le papier can work for the paper too, but le feuille de papier is a truly the piece of paper. Next we have le cahier, le cahier, which is a notebook or the notebook. Um, I will say that's traditionally like a spiral bound notebook. After that we have l'ordinateur which is a computer, l'ordinateur, which is a computer. Next, we have la dictionnaire, la dictionnaire. You probably guess that's the dictionary, la dictionnaire. Next, we have la gomme, la gomme is the eraser, la gomme, so there's a couple of feminine items right there. La regla, la regla is a ruler, the ruler. Le taille crayon, le taille crayon, you see crayon there, hopefully you remember that's pencil. Le taille crayon is a pencil sharpener. Next we have La Trousse. La Trousse is a pencil case. And then next we have La Calculatrice. La Calculatrice is calculator. And lastly we have Le Sac à dos. So you can have Le Sac or you can add the à dos. And Le Sac à dos is a backpack. And if you didn't have the a dos, le sac can just mean a bag. If you add le sac à main, your main is your hand, then it would be like a handbag. But le sac à dos is a backpack. And so those are your school supplies, your furniture, scolaire. Uh, enjoy using those and have fun speaking French.